That's why you see many times I'm standing up and going. Even if we loved each other, we hate each other from that moment on. I was saying that. I went to a certain country and I saw where they eat fufu in the morning. I hear uh, in America, even if you go in hotels, they say that's not really that food. I'm talking about the world we're about to hear. And then our, our, our usual tradition is we open. Break a 15 minutes. It's about a minute and a minute. Welcome, servant of God. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! I greet you in the name of Jesus Christ. I'm happy to be in the church of God. And I'm happy to see all of you. And uh, so that look, look like you are happy in the uh, church of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are going to uh, talk about the word of God. I thank God for giving me this time. I also thank the servants of God who are greater than us that gave us this time. I also thank God who brought all of you so that we could hear the word of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Like uh, the evangelist has already spoken, we are going to eat breakfast. So don't lose. Because if you don't see breakfast, you might lose lunch as well. Hallelujah! 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 Hallelujah. Uh, we, we are in time of winter, so you might get cold. We are in the church of God and so we need to be warm. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! We are in, uh, in hard times that are tiring as well. So don't let them scare you. Even if, you, if it's hard for you. Even if you're sick. Even if you're very cold. Or if you're very hot. Or if you're hungry. Or if you're full. Don't Hallelujah. let those days scare you. We are waiting for Christ and he will come. Once, once he comes, all the problems will cease to exist. Uh, it's possible that he comes with, with this body. Uh, he might come once we have already been separated from this body. But how are you ready? We are going to talk about the word of God very short. The title of this. Uh, so don't let the title is don't let the days uh, take the strength from your heart. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Don't let this time take the strength off of your heart. Without going any further, let us read the word of God. We're going to read the book of Job. Chapter 
Uh, that is uh, 26, chapter 27. Line 6. We're going to read uh, Job chapter 27. Line 6 only. Twenty-seven. 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 Twenty-six. To stomach me, it's not Ukugorora kakwanje ndakubangirije ngaho nzokurekura umutima wanje nduzokwigera unyagiriza no kuvya umunsi numwe muyanje yose dusubiremo ukugorora kakwanje ndakubangirije ngaho nzokurekura Umutima wanje nduzo kwigera unyagiriza no kuvya umunsi numwe muyanje yose amena badusomera no mucyongereza job at uh, 26 at uh, 27 line 6 i hold fast my righteousness and will not let it go my heart does not reproach me for any of my days hallelujah the Kananja Sumengo, Guchira Nuka Kwanja and Dagukomeje, Nabgo Nza Kurekura, Nabgo Umutima Wanja, Uza Jiricho Unshinja, Nidiho, Amen. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Murabiziko is in Huru Zomujitabo Chayobu. I know that you know the news for uh, in the book of Job. Namakuru Umunue Sazi. It's, uh, we know the story of Job and, and each person knows. You know the kind of uh, problems he faced. We, we all know that he faced uh, big uh, calamities. Uh, even his friends and neighbors. Even the wife. They told him to just refuse God. Uh, and some others told him that he might have sinned. That is why he was facing problems. But that wasn't the case. What I thank God is. It is because he gave him strength. And then he gave him the, the strength of the heart. And he said that even though all of these things are happening to me. I will continue my righteousness. I will not let it go. That not even uh, uh, my heart. Not even my heart will reproach me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Don't you feel like sometimes you might face uh, uh, bad days and you feel like you should let go of God? Because in our traditions, uh, we face uh, many uh, things, different days. There's a time to be happy. Time to be uh, sad. Time to be sick. And then we might lose our, our loved ones. Uh, we also might face war and we might try to flee. We might leave our own, thing, uh, our own stuff. It's many things. There's no way I can say all of them and finish. But even though that we face those, those times, stand. Don't let drain the strength in your heart. Be strong. Uh, be strong and have strength. And be strong on, uh, on our Christ or our Lord that has called you. 
Because they are the one, he, he's the one who will help you through all of this. So that those times don't take strength from us or hearts. There is something that requ requires from us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So ask to be strong in, in, in our salvation. So that you're not uh, wiggling, you're not moving. So that you're not weak and or uh, moving in your salvation. So that when the wind comes and other problems comes, you are standing strong. So don't let it move you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Uh, it's possible that you are uh, you are very familiar with uh, eating bones. Uh, so, uh, so that many times when a person is still young and they're a kid, they usually give them milk. Because milk is easy to swallow. Uh, and it they, they also helps with the body. But once a person uh, grows, they are able to eat bones. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Would you give a, ch a young child bones to eat? But a person that's an adult, they will eat bones and be able to eat it. I'm saying in terms of the body but in terms of the spirit uh, so the uh, bones is the things that are coming to you that are hard to deal with and you, uh, you remain with them and you stand strong and you eat the bones because you are no longer needing to eat, drink milk hallelujah, hallelujah. it's necessary that that you, you, you keep close to your heart to receive everything that comes towards you. Uh, whether it's making you uh, sad or bringing problems or what, whether, whether they come and you're not ready so that you may uh, familiarize your heart to receive all these things hallelujah, hallelujah. Uh, we heard two things it's, it's important to be strong in salvation because when you're strong in your, uh, you also make your heart strong and you familiarize yourself to receive all things that you, uh, you might uh, come, come from, from people your, your own kind uh, it's possible for these things to come from a church, the church that you pray in. Uh, it's, uh, it's possible to come from the people of the world. But wherever they come from, familiarize your heart to receive these things. In the life that we have here in the world, uh, without it being uh, there, uh, if, if it wasn't for being strong in our hearts, there's a lot of things that will make uh, uh, that will fall. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because once a person is strong in salvation, all the problems that comes, they continue to persevere. Also, they're curious. A person might be uh, looking over their a sick one. Uh, or uh, you, if you're in terms of sickness, things are hard for you. You start to look for places to get cure. And maybe you even go to the uh, witchcraft. The times are hard for you and, and you know, your heart is, is, is letting you down. And wherever you go to get a cure, you're not re receiving the solution you're looking for. So it's, it's good to have curiosity. 
tukamenya guhita mu kiza nikibi know the difference between good and bad hallelujah hallelujah umukristo kuze kandi wateguye umutima we a strong christian that has prepared their heart agira urukundo hallelujah they have love hallelujah eh nubwo umuntu yaba kwanga ariko uramukunda but even if a person hates you you still love them hallelujah hallelujah Truly let us be strong in our Christ. And also let us, us persevere. So the times are hard for us. Let us stand strong in them. Kandi hari giye tujya dutekereza ko ibihe bibi ari byo bitumara mu imbaraga gusa ntabwo ari ko biri. Sometimes we think that the bad times are the ones that are taking strength from us. That's not how it is. Ni bihe byiza bijya bitumara mu imbaraga. Even good days they take strength from us. Eh itera mbere rijya ritumara mu imbaraga. Or being uh, being too uh, future uh, willing uh, that can take can take us uh, our strength. Ibigezweho. The things that exist today ubukire bwinshi uh having too too much of uh, freedom umuntu ararengwa kibagirwa and a person may have uh, a, 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 too many things and they may be overwhelmed ibihe bikaguhindura and times may change you hallelujah hallelujah hara hantu twabaye umuntu yigeze gukiragira amafaranga menshi cyane and uh, there's a place that we live that with a person who had a lot of money if you are a refugee and you have and God blesses you and things are good and they will tell us they will say that show me how to behave show me how to uh, go around go about Vivaho, bijya bibaho. It's possible. Eh umuntu akumva yahindutse undi muntu kabisa. And you will see the person has changed to a different person. Ukumva ntusanzwe. And you feel like you're not normal. Imbaraga z'umutima zibazamaze kugenda. The strength of the heart has left you. Ibihe byabyamaze kugukuramo imbaraga z'umutima. The times has uh, taken strength from your heart. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Reka rero dukomere. Let us be strong dukomere ku mwami imana and be strong in our lord christ adukomeze guhagarara neza so that he may help us remain strong mu bihe byose stand in all times mwene data ibihe nibikumaremo imbaraga z'umutima don't let the uh, bad days take away your strength imana iduha umugisha bumvise ijambo ry'imana may god bless you all of you who have heard this word kuzote wewe ni mtakatifu haleluya asante kwa neno lako asante kwa yale yote waombaji walioyaombea kwa sababu wewe unajua yanayotustahili na ndio maana wewe ni Mungu siye lala wala husinzi kamwe unatosha kwa kila mtu Neno limekuja ndeo hilo tumelipokea lakini yupo mmoja adui mpanzi alivyotoa mbegu na kwenda kupanda kuna mbegu zinakwenda nje kando ya shamba na zingine mbegu kutumbukia katika miiba na katika miamba mbalimbali na udongo ambao ni mbovu haunambolea Hivyo adui anakuja wakati wa usiku anapanda magugu kwa sababu ni nia yake Hivyo tunakuomba Mungu karibu ndani ya mioyo ya wengi weka mbegu hii ambao ni mbegu ya kutuweka imara hadi utakavyokuja Yesu kanda ni yetu daima tusirudi nyuma kamwe bariki kanisa ambao wamekinga sikio na kusikia adui atokomee mbali na wajakazi wako tupate kuwa na imani kamilifu ni hivyo tunamwombea na mwingine baadhi anakuja atapanda mara nyingine yesu weka udongo mzuri ndani ya watu wako 
Tupate kusimama imara. Asante kwa mtumishi wako. Mbariki pale ametoa. Ongezea karama nyingine. Atakavyo simama na kusema au kunena. Bwana umuongezee baraka. Asante kwa sababu mefanya hivyo. Nasi tunasema asante. Ni ndani ya china la Yesu mwana wako mpendo tunaomba. Amena. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Praise the Lord. Bwana Yesu asifiwe sana. Praise the Lord. Tashimimana.